Um, I'm Ian Benadeo, and I designed this collection. Hi, everybody. Welcome to our spring and summer collection of Nataya 2012. Remember, Nataya is all about femininity, romance, sensuality. Inga puts her entire collection on showing off a woman's best assets. Uh, this first collection that I'm showing you is Inga's destination wedding, alternative wedding, and second wedding. Now, some people love to buy this and just put a denim coat over it, or a leather coat, and throw some boots on it. And we take the time to give you detail that nobody else gives at a price point that's affordable. This is actual embroidery done, corded embroidery. Look at the amount of tulle on this dress and the way it tears. You can tie it to give a more of a um, waistline, or you can let it flow as you walk. Apparel News in a fashion show a year ago described Nataya as dresses that float on air. Adjustable strap. Inga even takes care of that little detail you're worried about under your arms. Inga adds the fabric there. So when it's on the body, once again, it covers all sins and problem area. It's all about making a woman feel beautiful and feminine. This is one of my favorite dresses. I call this a Josephine dress. Very Bonaparte. Look at the embroidery on this. High-low hem, shows off your shoes, shows off your ankles, drops in the back for that really elegant look as you're walking down the aisle, or even going to the beach. Inga designs everything to cover up hips, to give you an allure on your bust line. It's all about romance. This is a new design for Inga, and I have to share something with you. Okay, once again, it covers up all arms. This is the sexiest dress on. Why? Inga took her lace and her tool. She designed it down the dress, which is very slimming. But everything with Inga has a trick on it. The lace here is designed to go right underneath the buttocks. With this dropping over the top, this dress gives you the sexiest backside. So when you're walking down the aisle, yeah, all eyes are on you for the good parts. The next little group we put up is kind of our mother the bride look. This is where Inga introduced a little bit more detail and color. Once again, we have the 10709 that you saw earlier in the ivory. Then we have an incredible lace dress. Go to A inserts. But one thing that Inga really does that I love, Inga actually does the illusion. This is fully lined in the back, but it gives any woman just an incredible backdrop neckline. Inga always comes up with kind of a European couture look on our product. She's done that new European asymmetrical neckline. Once again, incredible details on the bottom. Go to inserts. These are the kind of dresses you can wear to the beach or wear to the opera. This is one of my favorite groups of Inga's. I love our sportswear. You can actually wear it together as outfits or make it separate. And Inga, what do I always call this? Animals for grown-ups, whatever that means. So the animals for grown-ups, anybody who remembers the 70s and 80s, you can actually merchandise them as your store, roll it back together with other pieces, and you're still going to have an outfit left over no matter what. What Inga's done, she's taken a European couture look uh, that's very big in Europe in spring this year. She shortened it up, she did the gorgeous roses, but what Inga does is make it fit for every woman. Elastic back waist, a-line, covers all sins, it's flowing. Going back into a cami, bra friendly, great detail, cut wider at the hips, fuller at the bust. But then again, you can take this look, just put a white or gray sweater over it, put a pair of boots with it, put a pair of flip flops, take other items in your store, really dress it up by putting that romance and femininity of the tie up. Incredible little shrug jacket. Kind of based on a 1920s, but once again, there's a customer that wants to cover up her arms. Flowing piece, great colors, running it back in to the rose skirt again, but done in the rose. Pink color. <laughs> done in the pink color. But once again, I see this with just a great big white sweater. Throw some boots on it. Yeah, it's very Inga style. What I like to see people is, instead of using the tie as one outfit, use it with other things. Going back into this top, 
And by the way, everything here comes in a plus, in plus sizing. Put this top over a pair of jeans. Put a pair of Gucci boots on it, rock it out. I always like to say, In the worst, everything with ugly boots. <laughs> Showing the versatility. I call this group Granimals for Grown Ups. Now I want to show you the dress that Inga just twirled for you. If Inga would turn around for a moment. The different details that Inga does. She gives the illusion. It's actually cut under the buttocks. Gorgeous lace covering up problem areas. You don't have problem areas. But it's just the details that Inga does to make it more feminine. Then, I love this top. I picture this over a pair of straight leg jeans with a pair of Gucci boots. But if you want to go back to the whole feminine romance thing, put it over the rose skirt. Now, Inga's great if you just come over for a second. Inga designs this. But she also wears this. Inga put back on her boots with this. She'll put on the coat that you saw earlier. Inga's line is meant just to make you feel like a woman again. Now the final division that we want to show you is Natalia's Age of Love collection. It's designed for a younger, more flirty girl, and it's also a lot more price conscious than the details in our Natalia collection. Inga is going to explain to you her whole idea behind the concept. Um. It has color. That's the idea. <laughs> I'm, I want to be younger, more colorful, happy, um, Sunday morning type collection. Um, something that you feel great in and doesn't hurt your pocket. Perfect. Good for the wallet, good for the soul. That's, I like that. Yeah, I like that too. <laughs> it's we my phrase. Like I, I need to like to You need to write that down. Yeah. Good for the Trade wallet, for we it. like that. <laughs> yeah. So basically what we have here are, it's just a touch of our whole collection. It's three flirty dresses. And as Inga said, this is great for a Sunday morning fun little beach party, a little affair. Just wear it with sandals, wear it with heels, just have fun with this. Or a bridesmaid. If Absolutely. You want. Yeah. Speaking of bridesmaids, Inga's actually going to be doing the dresses with uh, My Fair Wedding with David Turo, which is going to be um, showing on the Wii channel from November through March, so you need to see us then too. So the three little dresses, well four of them actually, my favorite, and you can put color into it. There you go. Tell me about the dress. Well, um, it's turquoise, uh, and it's um, it's not only turquoise, it has two colors. Um, the color underneath is sort of mint, so um, it gives this iridescent and uh, sort of um, central um, uh, don't know what really color this is uh, kind of look um, and um, it has uh, of course uh, silk stitch embroidery which is also two shaded I sketched it myself uh, and a um, bunch of uh, uh, employees were uh, stitching it on a little frame like, so, you know, there is a lot of work into it um, it has chiffon bottom frill um, little satin trim and little fold here, pleats, pleats here as well, um, chiffon frills on the sleeve, finished with pico edge. Um, there's a lot about each dress. Um, most of my dresses are covered with details. I just love details and um, I have so much passion for it and I try to stash as many details as I can without it looking tacky. Um, so here it is. Yeah. Inga. <laughs> this is my favorite. Okay. Um, yeah. Um, this dress is uh, sort of uh, inspired by um, um, fairy tales, um, and it's uh, very Alice in Wonderlandish. So um, it has this uh, beautiful line that makes any woman look kind of thin because it's sort of like a feet and flare. And then uh, it goes right under the bust. It's not above the bust or you know in the weird lower place. Um, the sleeve covers everything, yet it's uh, transparent, so it makes you look like you have thin arms. Or, um, I mean, most of them are made to flatter a woman and flatter the femininity of a woman. Um, the embroidery is also original design, and um, it's not a material like that. It's not a lace, though it has definitely an ambience of a lace. Um, we, um, again, it's uh, done on the frame and it's chain embroidery, it's like traditional chain embroidery that, um, that's that been around for like ages, thousands of years. Um, and then it's finished with little scallops at the edge. 
and the lace, and um, of course some ribbons, packaging, uh, double layers, <laughs> iridescent color, um, yeah, all of that. So that's it. That's our major part. Yay! Well, everybody, we want to thank you for taking the time to watch our informal Natalia presentation. Remember, we have a lot more product. You can go online to www.nataya.com and go into collections. Um, you can always get a hold of me in the office. My number's there. And you'll see Inga and I at almost every major apparel show in the country for 212. We are a very close-knit company, and we're all about fun and romance and femininity. This is Mike. By the way, and I'm Inka Natalia. You're Inka? Yeah. Oh, I'm Mike. <laughs> Thanks, guys.